Hi guys. So I originally wanted to make a rainbow highlighter, but about 30 other YouTubers have already beaten me to it, so I decided to turn this DIY into a rainbow lip gloss instead. This is so pretty, glittery, and easy to make. This video is a collab with 5 amazing DIY YouTubers, and I'm sure these are familiar names to many of you. First up, there's Hayley Williams showing you how to make these incredible light up LED shoes. Then check out Nicole Skies with her hilariously original DIY stress ball hands. Timmy Tomato slayed it as always with this ice cream stress ball. And Alejandro Valdez made these delicious edible social media buttons. And lastly, the queen of giant makeup, Kim Spire DIY, shows you how to make an oversized Kylie Jenner lip kit. All of these videos are linked in the description box below, so be sure to watch, like, and subscribe. And now let's move on to my rainbow lip balm. So to get started, you'll need some colorful eyeshadow, some empty makeup pots and mixing tools, a candle, some plain white lip balm, and as an optional extra, clear lip gloss and edible glitter. Try looking for a flat container like this one so it looks as similar as possible to the rainbow highlighter. I ended up using a cheap drugstore brand of eyeshadow which is actually quite perfect because I wanted to use this color anyway for the lip balm. So you can just depot the eyeshadow into a different container and then wash and dry everything so that it's clean to use. If there was anything printed on the lid, you can easily get rid of that using nail polish remover. However, you have to work very quickly because the polish remover will cause the plastic to look cloudy. Just apply a tiny bit of nail polish remover with a cotton bud and as soon as you see the ink dissolve, wipe it off immediately with a wet paper towel to prevent it from corroding the plastic. You might still see some cloudy parts on the lid and a great way to fix this is using clear nail polish. After applying two coats, the plastic is shiny again and these containers look good as new and ready to be filled with lip balm. Scrape out some eyeshadow in rainbow colors. Eyeshadow pigment is always safe to use on lips in very small quantities. Then take two plain white lip balms and chop them into six pieces. It's a lot easier to use store-bought lip balm for this DIY instead of trying to make your own with wax and oil. Place one piece in a spoon and add some eyeshadow color to it. Then take an eyeliner or eyebrow pencil and divide your lip balm container into six equal parts. Use some scrap card to make some dividers that will fit across these lines. I'm simply cutting up the packaging of the MAC lip gloss that I'll be using later on in this video. Light a candle and use a spoon to melt the first lip balm color. I find that store-bought lip balm melts and hardens a lot faster than homemade lip balm, which is really useful for this DIY. Then hold your card divider into place and use a pointy tool to transfer the ball mixture over. I use the chopstick, but a tiny spoon handle or a knife tip should also work. By the time you finish, the ball should already be quite solid, so you can simply remove the card and move on to the next color. This time, you have to be careful not to get the orange into the pink. Try dropping the orange bomb closer to the card so that the mixture can flow naturally until it reaches the pink. Once you reach the middle, you can simply wipe off the card dividers and reuse them for the other side. I really love this process because you don't even need to use a stove, microwave, or put the bomb in the fridge or freezer. The lip balm hardens at the perfect speed so that it's solid enough to work with but still soft enough so you can blend the colors together. Once everything has been filled up, clean up any smears using makeup remover. Then wipe the outside of the container with makeup remover and your rainbow lip balm is done. As an optional extra, you can glaze the balm using lip gloss. I'm using MAC lip glass which has a really nice thick texture mixed with some edible glitter that I bought from Lola's Cupcakes in Topshop. Just mix everything together and use a brush to spread a thin layer across the top of your rainbow lip balm. Now I have to confess that the thumbnail for this video was slightly misleading because this lip balm actually goes on clear which you can see right here. However, this makes it a lot more suitable for everyday use because you can actually have fun making and using this DIY. If you actually want to have bright rainbow colors on your lips, then you have to mix the lip gloss directly with eyeshadow pigment. 
So here I'm adding some MAC lip glass to the same eyeshadow and glitter that I used earlier. Then I prepared my lips using primer, foundation and a little bit of lip liner. Use a thin brush to apply lines of gloss to your lips. Since there are six colors, it's quite easy to do this by eye. You simply need to put three stripes of color onto each side of your lip. So after making this video, I have a huge newfound respect for beauty gurus because it's ridiculously difficult to film yourself properly while applying makeup. Stuff like this kept on happening and the light started making the lip gloss melt so I was stressing out trying to take photos before everything just slid off. So I think I'm far better off sticking with DIY videos and I hope you liked this rainbow lip gloss tutorial. Don't forget to check out the other videos by Hailey, Nicole, Tim, Alejandro and Kim, all of which I've linked below. And I also want to mention that YouTube's official Creator Academy actually confirms that people do not have to appear in the same video for it to be a collab. But if you prefer seeing this as a shout out, then that's okay as well. These are just different words for YouTubers trying to support each other, so let's try not to get too worked up in the comment section about what is or isn't a collab. Thank you so much for watching and I'm sending lots of love to all my subscribers. Bye!